this year I've made a decision to help the next generation out with um, some coaching points and give them my, um, my side of football to the young kids and um, along with Brady as well, so it's um, been really good. As a young player growing up, um, we didn't have that support as from the AFL, but um, yeah, as we've seen the last year or so, that support from the um, Fremantle Football Club has given to the um, next generation and also to young Indigenous footballers and multicultural footballers really good. Brady usually takes some warm-ups, um, he's really good with that and I'll just um, just touch base with the kids with the skill part of, parts of things and just sit off the back of the group and help the boys um, with their handball if they're missing a kick and yeah, just help them out. Yeah, the Next Generation Academy, i um, really pleased to be involved and um, it's really important for me to get back to the community. Fremantle's last ever game here at the main stadium and it's a full house for Harley Bennell, two years out of the game, first game for two years, almost to the day, round 22, 2015. Ross just told me to keep my cool um, and just go into the game as any other game you've been playing. Um, just keep my cool and hopefully play my role for the team and yeah. Harley Bennell, first game for two years. He's fought his way back for this moment. And there are fairy tales. That's some type of reaction from all his teammates. Tabata, Bennell, time. Oh, he's cream. Elite talent, number two draft pick, that's why. Yeah, it was very special, you know. Um, obviously I've been in the game for a very long time. Um, and just to get, get a home game and um, you know, disappointed with the loss, but there's always, um, there's always light at the end of the tunnel.